Following on the heels of President Trump's call for a sharp increase in military spending to deal with threats like North Korea, the U.S. Senate has approved a mammoth defense policy bill for 2018. Now, the bill authorizes the Pentagon's budget for next year and sets guidelines on how the money is spent. Kim Hyo-sun reports. The U.S. Senate has overwhelmingly passed a roughly $700 billion defense policy bill for the next fiscal year, backing President Trump's call for a bigger and stronger military. The amendment to the National Defense Authorization Act, which authorizes a $81 billion on-year increase in defense budget, was passed with 89 votes in favor and just eight votes against. The legislation includes an additional $8.5 billion allocation for the Missile Defense Agency to strengthen missile defense. It also includes the Pentagon's pledges to defend the Korean Peninsula through the deployment of the THAAD anti-missile system and a nuclear umbrella. In addition, the bill lays out Washington's plan to enhance its extended deterrence over its allies in the Asia-Pacific region, including South Korea and Japan, by mobilizing all military capabilities, including nuclear and conventional. The House of Representatives passed its version of the bill in July, and the two versions must be reconciled before Congress can consider a final version. Kim Yo-san, Arirang News.